We're visiting the Midwest for Final Jeopardy today. Here's the clue. At about 90,000, it's the most populous U.S. city on North America's biggest lake. 30 seconds, contestants. Good luck. We had players from both coasts on Jeopardy! today, but no one from the Midwest. Let's see what happens. We'll come first to Hung Pham, who was in third place with $5,000. He wrote down, what is Green Bay? No, that's not correct. So you're going to lose just $1,025, leaving you with $3,975. Carrie Christian was in second place. What city did she think of? What is Minneapolis? It's closer, but it's not correct, I'm afraid. You're going to lose, ooh, all but a dollar. You're in third place with a dollar. Dave Rapp, our returning champion, had 19,600 going into final. That's a good score. Ooh, but he's going to lose a little bit. He also wrote Green Bay. No, this is the most important port on Lake Superior, which is Duluth, Minnesota. <laughs> Duluth, Minnesota getting its day in the sun on Final Jeopardy. What's going to happen to your score, Dave? You'll lose just 2,400. You have a total today of 17,200 and a two-day total of $47,200. You are now the longest running Mohawk champion in Jeopardy! history. Congratulations, sir. You'll be back tomorrow, and we hope we see you then, too. Take care, everybody.